What's going on, YouTube? Kale Ken coming at you with a black and white Wi Fi battle for our NU tier. And this team fucking sucks dick. And Nick P made it. And this team fucking sucks. Just look at this. I don't have a fucking stun fist. Anyway, on with the battle. I lead off with Jump Off because I'm predicting him to lead with Mesprit. Well, not really. I did, but then I thought it might be a Scarf Mesprit. So I switch out into Octillery because I thought he might try to trick me in my Octillery Scarf. So. Yeah, but he goes for the rock, so I figure he's not Scarf. I'm just going to go for the Water Spout, get as much damage as possible, because I'm Scarf, and I know I'm faster, even though Octillery's really slow and a piece of poop. So he's going to U-turn, and he's going to go into his Golduck now, and obviously I'm going to switch out because I'm Choice Scarf blocked into Water Spout. And I'm predicting to go for a Hidden Power. I didn't really know what Hidden Power would be. I was thinking maybe Electric, but looking at that damage, is not very effective. It's obviously Grass. So, yeah, that's going to be good information note for later. He's going to switch out. I'll go for Sleep Powder here, because why not? I know he's going to switch. And, uh, yeah, his Mesprit comes in to absorb the sleep, and uh, Nick P is just having fun, just being all high. Just look at him. He's just marinating in the sky. Let's look at him. Anyway, he goes into Licky Licky. I thought he was going to Torterra, so I went for the Giga Drain as opposed to the Leech Seed. And, uh... Yeah, Licky Licky is just a fat piece of poop with a long ass tongue and is really fat and a lot of HP. So I'll go for the substitute just to see what he wants to do. And he goes for the wish, and I have no idea what the fuck half Pokemon, half the Pokemon in NU do. So, uh, yeah, I thought he might flamethrower or something like the ones in, like the ones I saw in 4th gen. Anyway, I go for the Giga Drain again because I thought, you know, maybe he would want to switch into our terror predicting my leech seed, but he didn't want to do that, I guess. He just wanted to stay in and he thought the dragon tail would phase me out. But since I'm behind the sub, that doesn't happen. So now I'm gonna go for the leech seed, because I'm figuring he, he wants to stay in now, or he's going to stay in now. So I'm gonna go for the body slam. And that's gonna break my sub. But you know, that's whatever. So uh after turn effects, leech seed, leftovers, and uh what happens after that? I really don't remember what happens now. Oh, I switch out. I go into Derp, the Stunfisk, and I don't like Stunfisk because look at him, he's freaking Derp. And he decides to switch on the same turn. He goes into his uh, Magmortar, and I'm like a complete retard right now. I forgot I had a Ninetales on this, not Ninetales, wow. I forgot I had Rapidash on this team, and I forgot that Rapidash has uh, Flash Fire. So I still go for the Skull. I went for the Skull because of uh, super effective damage. But in hindsight, I probably should have went for the uh, the discharge, try to get the uh, the paralysis, and you know a stab. But he's going for the thunderbolt here. I guess he thought I was water type because I had skulls, but, but sunfist is actually electric ground. And here, right after this fire blast hits, it uh, it clicks in my mind that I I have a rapid ass just you know just marinating with the uh, flash fire. So I'm gonna go for the sleep talk. I get the rest, and I'm just like, come on, son. Really? So now I'm gonna switch on to Rapidash, and I'm figuring he's gonna go he's gonna keep going for the fire blast because it's the strongest move. And uh yeah, Rapidash just om nom noms that flash fire, fire blast, yes. So here I believe I go for the wild charge. Yeah, I go for the wild charge because I don't remember. Oh, I thought he was staying for some reason, that's why. And uh yeah, so I'm just gonna go for the flare blitz now, just to, just to uh just to KO the mess for it, and you know, why not? So Mesprit's dead, now I can put more stuff to sleep and poop like that. So he's going to go into his boss Rao, and I actually know what boss Rao does, because I've used one before. So I'm just going to go right out into Derp, as, uh, because I really wanted to get the static hacks. I know the Aqua Jet's coming, and I know the boss Rao, uh, Stunfist is weak to it, but I, I'm just like praying I get the static hacks, and there it is, the static hacks. So I'm like, yes, Derp did his job. So now I'm going to go into Octillery. I thought he would predict my... Uh, my energy ball, so therefore I went for the ice from expecting him to switch in his Torterra. No. Wait, why did I go for Surf? I predicted something weird. Oh, no, I, I predicted him to predict me to go for the energy ball, so I went for the Surf expecting his Magmortar to come back in. That's what happened. So now I'm just going to go back out into uh, Nick P, and he's going to go into Golduck. So right here, I thought he would switch, because I thought he wouldn't want his Golduck to go to sleep, but... I really should have went for the Sleep Powder as opposed to going for the Giga Drain because now Nick P dies and this Golduck is alive and not asleep. Granted, I probably would have missed the Sleep Powder because it's me using Sleep Powder. But anyway, he's like, I know he's locked into Ice Beam. My Rapid Ash has a 
low HP. So I'm just going to go for the Morning Sun here. And I'm pretty sure he didn't expect me to have Morning Sun because I didn't even know Rapid actually get Morning Sun. So I'm up to a comfortable amount of HP. So I'm just going to go for the Wild Charge. I was, gonna, I was asking people. I really didn't know if that would kill. But it does. I guess Magmortar has less defense or Ma Rapid Dash has more attack than I thought. It's like 299 max with a Jolly Nature. So here I'm just banking on the Paralysis. And I kind of just left Rapid Dash in his fodder. But he gets the paral Paralysis. And I'm like, oh, you know, more kills for Rapid Dash. Yes. So Rapid Dash is just going ham right now. He's got three kills. It's going in. And then he brings into Torterra. And I'm just like, you know, Flare Blitz, Stab, Super Effective, and Life Orb. It's going to take you out. I honestly thought about going for the, uh, and I got a crit. I'm pretty sure that crit didn't matter, though. It might have. I'm not sure. But, uh, I don't know why he brought Torterra in. I guess just to fodder it. I don't know. So then he's going to go into his Golduck here. But, now he predicts the Energy Ball. And that kind of makes me a sad panda face. Because this fat motherfucker, Licky Licky, is going to come in and just take it like it's nothing. It took, like, 1 16th, maybe from that. So, here, I'm just gonna go into Gooch, but Gooch is gonna get Dragon Tailed out, cause, uh, I don't know, he just does. And, Artillery comes back out, so I'm just like, well, Artillery's not really too useful right now, I guess I'll just go for damage, so I can get a free switch into something. So he goes for the Dragon Tail, it's gonna KO Artillery, Artillery just kinda marinated there anyway, I don't think he got any kills this battle. Anyway, so Gooch is going to come back out. I'm like, all right, Gooch, time to do what you do best. Rely on luck. So I'll go for the body slam, and there it is. I get the paralysis. And I'm like, yes. So here I here I started misplaying because I wasn't really paying attention to how much the body slam did or how much the headbutt did. So from that range, I probably could have went for... Uh, a headbutt, I got the flinch here, but next turn you're going to see I went for the headbutt, but I didn't get the flinch. Now I'm thinking that if I had went for the body slam, I would have I would have KO'd, and I would have had more HP from when the gold duck came in. It was spoilers, I lost this battle because this fucking team sucks major dick. But uh, yeah, I probably should have went for the body slam as opposed to the headbutt, and I'm still going for the headbutt. Just what the fuck was I doing? So I'm, yeah, because I was paralyzed, there was no point for me going to the headbutt. And now because I'm so low... Uh, he's gonna, uh, his Golduck's going to come in and use Hidden Power on me, and that's uh, Hidden Power Grass, so that means when Relicanth comes in, it's going it's going to die. And I have the wrong EVs on this. It has max HP instead of max attack, so I fucked up there, too. But, uh, yeah, that was a good game, I guess, even though the team sucks. Nick PM never goes on the team ever again and for the rest of my life. And, uh, yeah, uh, don't forget to check out Goblin Attack Force channel. It's, uh cool channel about Yu-Gi-Oh and stuff that me and uh, some other guys are doing. Cheese, uh, Leo, and uh, yeah, just go check it out. It'll be linked in the description and stuff like that. So anyway, yeah, no deal. Comments, comments, comments. Oh, good jazz. Okay, I'll catch you next time. Later.